I was diagnosed with monkey pops. This really sucks. Everybody always says, not me, not me. But everywhere <laughs> so as y'all know already i had a surgery monday so i just got done doing the ct scan on my head i honestly don't think that these doctors and nurses really know what to do this is day five having monkey pox if i was to shake your hand right now you would be able to catch it i don't know who i got it from i'm a barber so i'm just i'm touching people's faces i come in contact with somebody with monkey pox and i need a test i don't know anyway yeah Oh, like it's a little raw still. It fell off. I had to like take it off. It's in the healing process. Stay tuned. Ah! Like go through it. Want to stay under the radar because there's this big stigma that it's an STD and it's not. Here sometime soon. I hope. I just. I just really be blessed. Like I've been going through it. I be praying. I be like, oh God, you have to be doing something. You got something in the works for me. I don't know how to handle it. I just been hanging on. If you've ever had a seizure before, but you get really weak. Your body gets weak the whole next day. Like people usually go straight to sleep after a seizure. You know what I'm saying? They're just like tired. Like the body, the brain, the everything is just exhausted. Like it drains all your energy. They didn't communicate to each other. So I guess that was my first write up. And I was like, how you gonna write me up? I just told you like, I'm gonna bring a doctor's note. Like you can't force me to go to work. That's a, um, medical leave of absence let them tell me when i can go back to work so i can give you an answer as soon as i let them know what uh what was wrong with me they straight put me in isolation pink note on my door and closed the glass door and everything i was like okay isolation again oh uh, y'all are lucky i fucking love y'all because like this is embarrassing and i don't feel like i have to but i want y'all to know that it's possible and how I'm dealing with it, you know what I'm saying? Cause if it happens to you, you know, not like I'm dirty, you know what I mean? Like, touched, I'm a barber. I say hey to every fucking body. These motherfuckers come in and out of my crib every day. And I might be the only trans man that's out and said that he's had monkey pox. There might be different transgender care uh, services. I might even be able to get a hold of that. Might be able to help me or something like that. You know what I mean? Cause right now, I like I said, I can't even cut hair. Ain't no telling when I can cut hair again. Um, in my hospital bed, I was going through my um, my work page, and it said that I had been terminated. Well, my termination was coming up, and I was like, "What?" And he's saying, "But I try and keep my spirits up." And